MobiRise website builder tutorial. Hi guys, welcome back to another video. And in today's video, I'm going to be telling you about MobiRise. Now you can use this platform to create a very awesome website. So having said that, let's just jump into the video. So first up, this is the website right here, MobiRise.com. And over here, you can quickly download the entire setup for either your Windows device or your Mac device. You can go ahead and download it. It's a free program that you can download okay just simply download it wait a couple of seconds for it to download and once it's downloaded just simply click on it and install the software let me just go ahead and install the software it takes like a couple of minutes and you're basically done uh, while it's doing that let's just go ahead and check out the website over here it's completely free but there is an option to go you know premium and save a lot of money if you want to but you can go ahead and use the free version as well so over here they're basically telling us how it basically works it's a simple drag and drop blocks you just simply you know drag the blocks that you want over onto your website and add them and you can even you know edit the style and the colors you can over change overall the parameters of the website the overall fonts the colors it's absolutely amazing and it's really really easy to use so while it you know downloads in the background over here we can see that there's a special valentine's day deal going on so instead of 6999 kit it's just simply above $150 and you get all 56000 awesome blocks 139 premium themes and extensions that ends today so i'm pretty sure by the time you watch this video this deal would have ended but it's still pretty good so let me just show you how what you benefits you would get when you check out the premium ones so right here these are all the premium websites and templates so over here as you can see each theme and template it is worth 50 dollars and uh, there are also free themes as well so which i will show you as soon as the program has installed and over here as it's you can see it's installed so let me just go ahead and log in with my google account so that you guys can understand how it looks like as you can see you have signed in successfully click on ok and wait for the program to load up yeah english is good and there we go so okay this is how it looks like so this is the full screen intro we have button one button two we can go ahead and add other the buttons but basically this is how it looks like this is basically your you know website over here and basically tells you how to create it it's like a your dashboard and you can switch to the mobile view over here as well so we'll just keep it on the desktop view and go ahead and start building your website so over here you can see you have pages you have sites account and extensions and stuff like that so let's go ahead and click on my site and over here let's go ahead and create a new website so when i create a new website it gives you a couple of different options let's give it a second to load up okay so over here as you can see all of the themes have loaded up and these are all the templates that we are going to need so there we have we can see we have a lot of different templates so we have agencies we have you know photo shoes crypto wallets we have like mobile applications vending machine bakery workouts whatever you know you want you can go do it over here these are some of the pages template as well you can go ahead and search for one as well and if you click on themes we have all these different themes as well so the difference between pages and themes is in pages you get to choose which pages you want and in themes you get the whole website so let's go ahead and check out a theme so over here i think this theme looks pretty good it's colorful and it looks pretty good so let's go ahead and click on that and uh this theme isn't available for our account. We have to buy this theme. It's not free. So let's choose this one. This is not free as well. What about this one? Mobilize 5. Okay. So this is the free theme. Over here, we get these types of pages. So we get the company, the portfolio, the shop, the event, and the agency and the photo. So let's go ahead and click on company and click on that. And do you want this site based on Mobilize theme template? let's go ahead and click on ok so our entire website has just now changed to that template that we had so and we can go ahead and you know just edit some of the themes as well so over here we can see we have a bunch of different options so we have block parameters we have save to user block and we have to remove block as well so it, it all depends upon you so to edit a you know specific part of the page all you have to do is just hover your mouse around it and it'll get highlighted like this what we can do next is all we have to do is just simply click on this text or whatever like i select it and now i can go ahead and make it bold unbolded make it bold i can make it italic and i can even add some link to it as well i can change the entire text and stuff like that if i click on over here click on block parameters we can see we have a bunch of different options we have the overall size the bottom the image size as well 
we have reverse we have text image colors video you know we can even change the overall background color of it let's go ahead and change it to blue as you can see it's blue now let's keep it you know uh, this pale bluish color or whatever now let's go ahead and change some of the block parameters of this one and can we go with the different color uh, I don't think so but we can overall change the font of the text so we have tile 3 we have tile 2 we have title 1 let's keep it at title 3 and we can even move the block as well so over here we can drag the block down so just simply you know click on it and we can go ahead and drag it to how wherever we want it uh, it's very it's all very simple and really easy to use and down below if we wanted to you know change some of the elements over here as you can see if i click on the arrow key or that element key we got all these bunch of different element key icons that we can use and it's all just very easy and very you know fun to use you can do whatever you want with it and it's all you know pretty simple and really easy to use and it's all free as well and you can choose whichever one you want and you can add extensions to your website as well so if i click on extensions we get all these different types of extensions and as you can see they're all they're all worth 49 dollars 50 dollars whatever you choose you can go ahead and add them to your theme as well so right now this was my site over here so let's go ahead and edit this site and over here as you can see we have the editor over here now this is the simple editor as you can see we get the primary colors over here we get the title we get the rounded buttons as well let's do that we get underlying links so that people can know that's a link we get animation on scroll as well and we get scroll top to bottom as well so we'll add that as well and then we have menus we have a text over here we get the overall buttons and link colors and the primary link as well i'm going to change that to this one uh actually i'm going to change that to a bit darker color i think that looks pretty nice okay so over here as you can see this is how it looks like so let me just go ahead and change the color of this one as well there we go this one as well and another awesome thing is that if you wanted to like you know add like a simple video in the background all you had to do was just simply click on the button you could go with you know image and over here you get the image over here and you can go ahead and change that to however you want it so it's really simple and it's really easy to use just simply click on it and you can go ahead and change the image if i ch click on the image i can go ahead and change it to whatever i want and over here as you can see i have a bunch of different options so let's we can choose whichever image we want if we have our own image all we had to do was just simply upload it and to upload it all you had to do is browse click on browse my computer and over here click on browse computer and choose whichever image you want and that's really easy so for now i'm just going to keep it at that one and over here down below we can as i said before we can change anything we want we can change the text we can change these images and we can change these logos these icons anything we want and it's all free and what if you wanted to you know change the name of your theme all you had to do is come over here on the left side and click on change the site name and over here it'll it'll open up a bunch of different options for you and you can just change the name to anything you want you can connect your own domain name and you can have your own domain as well so right now this is going to be your domain and you can add in your own domain if you want to and simply connect to it and you can just simply go ahead and publish your website over here and you have all these different optimizations that you see over here and you can resize all the images if you want you have seo analytics cookie alert and all these other options as well now another thing that i wanted to do wanted to tell you guys was if you wanted to add a different page all you had to do was come over here and click on pages and you can see you have the home page over here and you can click on create a new page and you can you can add another page as well so you have these different themes these different pages from that theme that you had or you can go ahead and add a blank up page over here simply click on ok and you can go ahead and you know click on page settings and you can change the settings of that page as well so over here down below this is your page settings and if you click on this button you can open up this block option over here and then you can start adding these blocks into that page as well so these are the headers over here you have your options so you have features you have articles you have images and videos you have peoples you have the contact page you have the you know socials footers or whatever and stuff like that so over here these are the footers these are the forms and these are the footers so as you can see we have already added a footer so we don't need to add that and then we have the news we have lists numbers we can add whatever we want and it's really simple all we have to do was click over here 
or click on an icon and it just simply adds it to over here as you can see at the bottom of the page or wherever your page is and then you can you know simply change it over as well so this was my secondary page you can add whatever you want and once you've done you know editing your website all you have to do is click on publish and it will you know help you publish the website so over here this is going to be your domain name you can go ahead and change that and then you can have the publish changes only you have the local drive folder or ftp if you click on ftp then you will have to do a lot of you know other things as well like you know coding and stuff like that you need to have an ftp number or and uh, stuff like that and uh, then you can go ahead and publish the changes or you can just go ahead and click on mobirize and that way you can change your domain name and click on publish that way you won't have to you know deal with a lot of other things but if you choose you know the local folder then you can save this website over onto your computer and then later on upload this website onto mobirize or onto your wordpress website or however you or whatever you want so if you have any questions let me know in the comment sections down below and i'll be sure to answer them and if you enjoyed this video be sure to hit the like button subscribe to our channel and turn on post notifications and having said that i'll catch you guys in the next video and until then take care and goodbye